hello guys welcome back to the channel on today's video i'm going to be teaching you how to use this app called bybit this particular one to make money for yourself on a daily basis for those of you that don't know bybit is a crypto exchange platform where you can trade on btc ethereum and other cryptocurrency and make money now this is not futures trading this is not sports trading we are talking about p2p trading what is p2p trading p2p trading is something like a marketplace where you can buy and sell dollars buy and sell btc buy and sell ethereum and some other little cryptocurrencies now for you to make money on this platform with the p2p market you need to be a merchant now let's open the app and see how it looks like i'll click on it to open now this is what the exchange looks like you can see the interface of the exchange you can see all the features available here you can see all the features available you can see the trades btc ethereum apex mint and so on and so forth now which one are we capitalizing on we are capitalizing on p2p trading let's click on p2p trading now this is just an important warning they normally give click on acknowledge now here is where you can buy dollars this is where you can buy what dollars and this is where you can sell this particular place if you click on sell you can sell your dollars here now there's something i want to explain here there's something i want to explain assuming you want to buy dollars there is an amount that each merchant has that they are selling for this person now this person called josie he's online that's why you are seeing this green logo on him because he's online but those are not online you will not be seeing the green icon on them so now he says his limit is from nine thousand naira to nine thousand fourteen naira this is the limit and he's selling it for one thousand six hundred and ninety four naira which is almost one thousand seven hundred and six naira difference this person is selling from one thousand naira to one thousand seven fifty but this person is offline so assuming i want to buy i will not be going for this person that is offline because it's going to take time for him to release the um dollars to me now this person is online and he's selling one dollar for 1696.85 kobo his limit is from 33,200 to 33,256 kobo that is how much they are selling now for you to become a merchant on this app to be able to sell dollars like these people do there are requirements from you now let's go and see the requirements once if you want to see the requirements you click on these three dot lines and click on this user center now you can see this is my own and with david my email is verified my sms is verified my identity identity verification is verified the only thing required from me now is the deposit what is this deposit this deposit is something like a security deposit that bybit exchange requires from all merchants to deposit so that anytime you have any issue with anyone and you are not able to fulfill your own side of the bargain from your de security deposit they will credit the other person so anyone coming here trying to scam people if you are a merchant then you are at risk because your security deposit will be deducted and paid to the seller if it is found that you are at fault but if you are not at fault you will not be debited now how do people get into fault with this p2p trading most times so many people come here trying to scam people on the p2p market how do they try to scam people someone will place an ad that i want to buy so so amount of dollars and they will send money to the merchants and the merchants will refuse to release the dollars to them did you see now if the person reports to buy bit because there's an option for reports if the person reports to buy bit buy bit is going to hold a court order between the two of them and the cs will come into intersection between the two of them and start asking questions like let me see your account details let me see your last transaction let me see this let me see that so the big question now is how do i make money after becoming a merchant after applying to be a merchant which i'll be showing you on my next video how to apply to become a merchant 
this is how you make money from this app you go to this three dash line this three dash line that you can see here click on it click on my ads come a because this is what they are requesting from me this security deposit which i've not deposited let's click on it to see how much they are requesting i deposit now can you see they are requesting i deposit a total of 1000 uscd this money is still yours you are just depositing it for security purpose it can be withdrawn anytime it can be withdrawn anytime but after withdrawing it that means you are no longer a merchant anytime you want to start trading again you will have to deposit it so after depositing this security deposit you still need another funds to do your buy and sell now this is what you do after becoming a merchant you click on post now you can now post ads can you see that everything is completed on mine the only thing required of me is the security deposit for me to start selling here now you make money from posting ads you can post an ad and say you buy dollars at so so rate let's say you reduce your own price this person is selling for 1694 you can reduce your own price to 1692 1690 now you will see people that will be willing to sell their dollars to you now you go back to sell order you go and place a sell order and you you can see that the cost of sell order is higher than buy order do you know why it is so because merchants are the ones buying from people that come to sell their dollars so they will buy it at a lower price from you and sell it at a higher price you will be saying that you can be selling this at a higher price of let me say four naira difference five naira difference now let's do some calculation if you go to your calculator and check assuming you are trading with five hundred dollar or one thousand dollar and you are selling with a difference of four naira four times one thousand dollars you are making four thousand naira per transaction remember this is just buy and sell buy and sell you're not sending your money money to anyone you are not sending your funds to anyone everything is in your control assuming you're able to do this five times a day which is very very possible because immediately you buy you sell immediately like it doesn't waste time it's not like something you post and you sell the next day bybit is a very very busy marketplace where you can sell your dollars quick and buy your dollars quick now let's check if you're able to sell five times per day times five this like you're making twenty thousand naira every single day someone that is making twenty thousand naira every single day times seven days in a week because there is no day that is exempted this is one hundred and forty thousand per week in a month you are making five hundred and sixty thousand naira this is dependent on how long you are willing to trade on this so my next video i'll be making a video on how to register how to become a merchant and how to fund your account See you guys in my next video. Bye.